Hey everyone, welcome back to another high quality foodie feature here on the channel where today I'm headed into Del Taco because it's tamale season and they've got a brand new version of them that I definitely want to check out. So stay tuned because the Cholula smothered tamales are up next. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. Thank you for choosing Del Taco. What can we get started for you? Yeah, peep this out. You know, I've got a mobile order pickup for Ian for two of the Cholula smothered tamales and that's it? Okay, you can pull up to the window. Great, thank you. All right, so I definitely had a lot of fun checking out these tamales the last time around. So if you're curious to see my original thoughts on them, take a look at that review popping up on your screen here right now and absolutely hang tight till the end of this review for a special message. How you, How you doing? Thank you. Appreciate you. Happy Thanksgiving. Stay frosty. All right. Bye bye. All right, guys, let's peep this out. Tamales are back at Del Taco, filled with shredded pork and wrapped in a traditional corn husk. So happy holidays to you as we go in in the Cholula smothered tamales. And already I'm getting nice hints of Cholula hot sauce in the air. I'm thinking this is going to be pretty tasty. So what we've got here are two of the famous tamales at Del Taco featuring seasoned shredded pork on the inside and a very thick amount of stone grated corn masa on the outside. And it's looking pretty nice, guys. I have to admit I'm digging the presentation of this one. Finishing it off, we've got a dollop of sour cream and cilantro on top for color. And I gotta say that Cholula hot sauce going along with it is looking pretty lovely. So let's confirm the goodness for you. I think it's gonna be great. It's the Cholula smothered tamales here at Del Taco. Let's peep out this flavor. All right, so as you guys know, especially if you're regular viewers of my channel, I am not a fan of cilantro, I mean at all. I absolutely despise it. So aside from the color aspect of it because of the holiday season, the greenery is appreciated, of course, but I'm looking at it as more of a garnish. I am not getting into this at all, but as you can see, the presentation is pretty slick on this. And like I said, I'm getting nice hints of that Cholula hot sauce in the air. I am thinking this is gonna be pretty tasty. I really am. Okay, so before I hopefully confirm the deliciousness that these are gonna be, and like always, if you guys are fans of high quality, delicious looking food reviews, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to tap that bell icon so you can be notified as soon as brand new content drops every week. All right, let's get a little bit of everything, which is really just some of the tamale, the sour cream, and that Cholula goodness here. Man, this is nice, actually. There's actually a decent amount of that hot sauce on the bottom, but lots of that corn masa on the inside as well. Well, I should say shredded pork on the inside as well with the masa on the outside. Let's give this a go. The initial bite of the Cholula smothered tamales here at Del Taco. Let's do it. Mmm. Oh, yeah. It's taking me back to the last time. Very thick. But that Cholula hot sauce right away. Whoa. And as usual, I've got nothing to drink today. Why do I do this to myself? For you guys, obviously. Mmm. Tasty. All right, let's go for a little bit more. That was a little bit more masa than anything, to be honest. But... Let me go for a little bit of the shredded pork action. There's more of it on this one here. Take a look. Decent amount all the way through and through. And I'm glad the sour cream is kind of lighting it up just a little bit in the flavor department, but cooling it down because the heat of the Cholula, it's name brand Cholula hot sauce. It's doing its job. It really is. Mmm. These are so good. So good, in fact, instead of just showing you just the plate again up close, let me lift one of these for you because the sour cream it's very contrasty here. It's kind of blowing it out just a bit. But as you can see, guys, a decent amount of masa for sure. The pork is decent. I mean, there are some parts of it that actually have a little bit more than others. But overall, what I am getting is nicely done. And that Cholula hot sauce, a lovely situation. So let me grab another piece here, see if I can get it completely cut open. There we go. All right, let me see if I can try and show you this as carefully as possible here. On the inside, I'll lift it up. Shredded pork sticking up like a candle wick right over there, but you know, it's seasoned. It's definitely nice and flavorful, but the corn masa is really overshadowing really everything on this, along with the sour cream and the hot sauce. It's good, but I really kind of wish as I'm getting further in that there was just a little bit more meat, but overall super flavorful still. Hang on. Mm, yeah. All right, let me swing this around here and I'm gonna lift the other side because this one absolutely has a lot more meat on the inside as it's flopping over, as you can see a lot more there. So let me flip it around and we'll go for that side. And I'll go for a bigger chunk this time also. Yeah, this is really, really thick, really thick. Let me get rid of some of the cilantro action and we'll lift this up. There we go. Take a look at that. A much better shot, a better representation of the shredded pork. Let's give this a go. I think this is gonna be the bite. Mmm, and it is. 
Yeah, definitely lots of shredded pork action in that bite for sure. That was very, very hearty, but also a little bit more on the saltier side because there was so much of it at one time. The nice creaminess of the sour cream is really adding to the overall flavor. And then the heat coming up on the back end from the Cholula hot sauce is just making it that much more. So super delicious, salty initially, creamy, and then heated. But guys, a lovely situation. Let me go for one more bite because I really want to. This is really good. And it's a holiday treat. They pretty much do this every year and I really dig it. The quality of these for fast food tamales is not bad, guys, not bad at all. And again, the inclusion of Cholula hot sauce, guys, the name brand goodness, you can't go wrong with that. You really can't. Mmm, banging, really good. So yeah, lots of tasty holiday goodness with this one, minus the greenery on my side, naturally, with the cilantro. But overall, presentation-wise, not bad. The quality of what you're getting is fairly decent as well. And again, that Cholula hot sauce, a lovely situation. So let me go for one more little bite of this one, then we'll close this one out after the rating. But guys, it's just as tasty as I remember from last year, but with a little bit more heat, as there should be because of Cholula. Pretty good, hang on. Yep, so definitely a really nice holiday treat and a tradition over here at Del Taco here as I'm trying to balance this on the fork for you. But as you can see, right now you can get two for four or five bucks if you want to add the Cholula hot sauce. So they add a dollar premium for that. And it is worth it because the name brand goodness really makes this shine. But as it stands, guys, a very nice tamale for fast food and absolutely a very decent flavor overall. Very solid on this. Eat one today. Save some for tamale. All right, before we get into this part, let me just say that was a little difficult to balance literally three quarters of a tamale at the end of a plastic fork. Hopefully the shake wasn't too bad for you. You guys are probably gonna let me know in the comments down below. But guys, very solid on the flavor overall with that one. And I gotta say, the inclusion again of Cholula hot sauce a major highlight. Naturally, that is the promo going on right now with their regular crispy chicken. So I kind of expected with the tamales coming back, of course, that absolutely needed to be an option on the menu. And thankfully it is. And it adds so much flavor overall as hot sauce usually does. But name brand hot sauce, easy recommendation, guys. That's pretty tasty just for that. So with that said, I'm going to have to give the Cholula Smothered Tamales here at Del Taco a pretty rock solid 9 out of 10. And the only reason it's not the perfect 10 out of 10 is because one of my tamales was a little on the anemic side in the filling department. As you guys saw, there really wasn't a lot of shredded pork in that one. But what was there was flavorful. But naturally, there was just more of the stone ground masa to kind of fill up the gap there. But still, plenty of the Cholula hot sauce to go in that, as well as the sour cream, a lovely situation. And in general, a pretty banging value. Even though 5 bucks is a little up there, I think, for 2 what you're getting quality-wise for a fast food tamale is pretty awesome. And it's got that name brand Cholula hot sauce. That really is the main thing. Okay, so now the obvious question. Aside from asking you if you guys are fans of tamales, because if you've made it this far into the review, I venture to guess you probably are. If you've got a Del Taco in the area, are you personally going to be giving this one a shot? Drop some comments down below. Is this like a favorite for you over at Del Taco every holiday season? And now that it's got Cholula hot sauce, are you even more excited about it? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Hour Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Yes, sir, some pretty tasty stuff for the holiday season over here at Del Taco, as always is the case with their tamales, with or without the Cholula even as well. But do yourself a favor, get the Cholula. It's pretty awesome. Hey guys, real quick, let me take a quick moment to wish each and every one of you a very happy Thanksgiving. By the time this video goes live, it's gonna be right up on the holiday. I hope you guys have a very, very festive day filled with plenty of tasty treats and togetherness with those close to you and those virtually that can't be with you as well this year. This has been a crazy year, I know, but let's just do the best we can. Have a very solid holiday and again, my heart goes out to each and every one of you. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya. Thank <laughs> you.